Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. Um, my background's different because I am now at home in Germany, so sorry if my lighting's off. I don't have my lights here with me, but I'm going off natural sunlight here, so I'm hoping this works, and I'm hoping to get this done before it gets dark. So, yes. Um, sorry, it's gonna be at a weird angle. Anyways. I wanted to do this um, beauty haul. I got a lot of stuff from BH Cosmetics and Coastal Sense before I flew out, but I brought it here with me because I wanted to show you guys what I got and kind of do a mini review, but today's not going to be that review. It's just going to be showing you guys what I got, and sorry for rambling, but yeah. Anyways, I'm going to start off with stuff from BH Cosmetics because it's the least amount of stuff that I got. I got this Ultimate Brow Palette. It looks like this. It's nice, sleek. Then you open it up, and then you get all these different colors. Um, from what I can tell, these bottom ones are all gel, and then the rest are all powder. So I'm pretty excited because, yeah, eight brow powders and four wax shades. And yes, I'm pretty excited because I've been trying to experiment with like my brow colors and stuff like that without getting the expensive stuff you know but trying to get some new products in so I got this and I finally finally got the Carly Bible palette it looks really pretty if you can't tell and it comes with a mirror which I'm not going to show you but it comes with these two gorgeous colors and these are all eyeshadows and then these are all I want to say let me read it yeah, and highlighters, but you know me, I don't, I oh, just dug my nail into it, I don't follow rules, I'll use any of these as eyeshadows, but these are really pretty, if you guys want to swatch test, I will show, I'll swatch all these for you, but gorgeous, it smells funny, I'm wondering if it's just because I just opened it, but. Then I got, this one I did open. I couldn't wait because I was really excited. This is just a HD brow pencil, pencil in the shade Brunette. It comes with a little spoolie. And then it comes with like the pencil part that you can go up. Um, Someone told me that it's like the Brow Wiz, but I don't want to buy the brow wiz just yet because I'm not good at my brows right now so I want to get better before I buy something more expensive. So I got that and then I got three of their liquid lipsticks because every other color was sold out. So I got three of them and I can show you these and I will swatch them for you. So these are the three colors I got, and they are in Cha Cha, Serena, and Princess. Like I said, I think there were eight of them, but they were all like literally all sold out. So these are the only ones left in stock, and I'm waiting for the other ones to come back so I can buy them. But this is Cha Cha. It's super pigmented. It feels watery, type, kind of. Not like it's moussey, but it doesn't look like it spreads too much. This is Serena. It's got a nice little doe foot applicator. It is super smooth and it is super pigmented. And then this was in Princess. It's a nice bubblegum pink. Hopefully you guys can see this. And my color's not too off. It's kind of like a magenta-y color. This is more like of the nudie pink and that's more of a bubblegum pink, but 
They look really pretty. They came, they went on really smooth, so I'm excited to try them out. But my other stuff I got was from Coastal Sense. They were doing a sale that was like 50% off of everything of their entire store. So I had to get some stuff. I got a new blending brush and then a new flat top buffer brush because I don't know where my other one went. And it's really sad because I really like that one. So I got two brushes. I got three of their pre-made palettes. This is their fall festive one. I got a winterberry one and a think pink one. So I will show you guys these. They're pretty nice. They're hard. These are the first time I've ever bought their palettes. So we'll see. It comes with a nice big mirror and these colors are gorgeous. I'm really digging this one and these greens that they have, that burgundy and that blue. Oh my goodness. I don't want to swatch these just yet because I am going to do a swatch, the swatch thing so I'm going to wait. But here's one. This is their fall festival palette. And it comes with 12 interchangeable colors, so I know you can change these colors out if you want to. This is their Think Pink palette. It makes me think of Breast Cancer Awareness because it's definitely one of those pinky palettes for that. And these are those colors. Oh my goodness. Look, they're all shimmery. Well, your top row is matte, this one's shimmery, and this is all the... Like, they're shimmeries, but it's black and grays in there. It looks absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. And then the last palette I got like this is called the Winterberry palette. And it comes with plums and a silver and burgundies and mainly just purples. Look at those colors. Those, those are gorgeous colors. I'm trying not to flash you with a mirror that you can't see anything. So, really pretty colors. I'm really excited to swatch these. I have not touched them at all. I would show you guys right now, but I'm going to do a swatch video, so I want to keep them all nice and pretty until then. Then I got these um, little, I can do these ones for you. These are um, just eyeshadow sets of four, and if I'm reading it right, it's Mimosa, Deep Cantaloupe, Bright Tangerine, and Volcanic Blast. And let's see. They're actually pretty pigmented. Like, I'm trying to get my finger in there. Do you see that? Oh my goodness, look at that one. Whew. These are pigmented, man. I'm hoping from this that those are going to be just as pigmented, but they look really pretty. And then I got these, these palettes I saw on their website. They were called Revealed Palettes, and they remind me very much of the Naked Palettes. So I'm going to show you. So these are in their containers what they look like. Like, they're literally... The same thing, in my opinion. Like, this is Revealed, Revealed 2, Revealed 3, and Revealed Smoky. And then, if you remember correctly, I got them with me. The Naked, Naked 2, Naked 3, and Naked Smoky. So, I think these are kind of like a knockoff of the Naked palettes, but let's take a look at them. These come with 20 eyeshadows, though. Oh, yeah, I can see that. So this is the revealed one. It doesn't come with a mirror, it's just the eyeshadows. And here's your naked one. So very similar in the colors, at least for the first one. Let's see, revealed two. So here's Naked 2. Sorry, try not to blind you guys. 
And here's Revealed 2. Pretty much it looks like it's the same color concept in each of them. Let's see. Again, 20 eyeshadows. And these only come with 12, I want to say. Yeah, 12. These only come with 12. So 20 versus 12 you get more. But they look like there is just kind of like a knockoff version of it. A cheaper version. Again, these were on sale when I got them. So these were only $12 instead of $24. So here's the Revealed 3. And here's your Naked 3. I feel like your Naked 3 has more pinks in there instead of these have more like gold and plummies in there. And then let's see, Revealed Smoky. So here's your Revealed Smoky, and then here's your Naked Smoky. Pretty much like the same colors, I want to say. Like same color concept, not exact same colors, but I'm going to do a swatch video on this too, so I don't want to swatch these right now, but I will definitely do a review where it shows the Revealed swatches and then the Naked swatches, and then you can see the color differences. Um, but that is all I got. I got a lot of stuff. I'm really excited to try these out, especially if these are like kind of like knockoff brands of the Naked palettes and you don't want to buy the Naked palettes because they are exp more expensive. I think they're $54 or $49 or something like that. These were only $12, but they were on sale. So normally they're $24. So if you want to buy a cheaper version and if these are cheaper versions, I will definitely let you guys know. You do get more shadows. But I will be, I'm excited to try these guys out. And I hope you guys like this video and I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, help me get my word out there. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.